President-elect Barack Obama has arrived in Washington for a meeting with President Bush. Obama and his wife, Michelle, just pulled up to the White House in the past 15 minutes. They were greeted by President and Mrs. Bush. The President and President-elect will tour the White House and talk about the economy, the war in Iraq, and other major issues. CBS 4 Susan Roberts takes a closer look at what we can expect from today's meeting. First things first for Barack Obama. The president-elect took his young daughters to school this morning in Chicago before heading to Washington and his first ever visit to the Oval Office. The president invited the president-elect to tour the White House and to discuss some of the pressing issues his new administration will face, including the struggling economy. But before they even sit down, a show of pageantry is expected as both men walk together along the White House colonnade and into the Oval Office. All of us must ensure that the next president and his team can hit the ground running. After a campaign filled with attacks from both sides, President Bush has been gracious and cooperative, and so has Mrs. Bush. She will give Obama's wife, Michelle, a tour of her new home today. President-elect Obama has also taken a very different tone now that the campaign is over. He has made it clear that this country has only one president at a time, and for now, that man is Mr. Bush. I'm going to go in there with a spirit of bipartisanship. But once Obama takes office, he is expected to quickly use his executive powers to reverse the Bush administration's policies on stem cell research, oil drilling, and other issues. As for Obama's remaining weeks as a U.S. senator from Illinois, his new chief of staff says the president-elect will likely remain in Chicago, setting up his economic team and formulating his policies.